I'm editing now. We got The Simpsons coming up in this new combo video, but I wanted you uh, to know that in Austria, Sebastian is a regular viewer of our YouTube videos, and Joe Garrett from England, I had to look at the name, who goes by the name of Stampy and also Squashy, they're YouTubers, Stampy and Squashy. Thank you for watching, and I'm glad you watch our videos regularly. I certainly have enough of them. But anyway, oh, and by the way, it's Thursday night. Do you hear the band? They're playing. But what we're going to show you now, we filmed earlier. So there's no band tonight. Anyway, enjoy. We are opening our combo video with our 31st Simpsons that we have sold. Dare I say it, it's the nicest one we've ever had. It's beautiful. Look at this thing. Look at it. It's beautiful. Oh, a bunga, man. Uh, I think all the plastics are pretty much perfect. Uh, Playfield's gorgeous. High shine. Of course, we have all fresh rubber on it. Super bright LEDs on this. Um, very selective. They, they put the obviously yellow LEDs here, but purple up here for the uh, donuts. We also decided to put the pink here to light their faces, give them a little pink color. <sighs> Look at the cabinet. Stephen had to do just a little bit of touch-up, not much, to bring it back to its former glory. Super bright color. It's gorgeous. Stephen did repaint some of the white here, or the off-white to match it. Obviously, we have new flipper buttons. The rails have been painted. It's beautiful. Look, look at this side. Can you hear up on the roof? We're finishing our roof. Another twenty thousand. It's costing seventy-four thousand dollars. Plus tax and freight. Anyway, real glass. Real glass. Nice break display. Our button battery that the customer can change down the road. And uh, the nice thing about that, you don't have to drill a hole. It actually fits in the holes perfect. Really worked out well. Uh, also here, we have all new capacitors on the power supply. And the board here, I think I've told you many times, that relay is ice cold now. So you have to reheat that, that board. I do want to point something out. I'm going to do this at all Data East games, I think. This plug, and I think it's this one. I think it's this one. Nope, it's this one. These two can be reversed. See these two plugs? They can be reversed. If you do, you're going to be in for an awful lot of hurt. You will blow up stuff unbelievably. They so, have the same pin. So don't let Johnny do it. <laughs> do not. Now, Real good case of point, you always have brown wires in the plug that plugs into the logic board. That's all coil wires, all brown on this one, on the uh, Data East games. And these are mostly black. So, brown on the top and black below. That's, that's a major mistake, especially if you had to take the head off. So if you take the head off of your machine, do not rely on memory. Those plugs will cause you hurt. It did for us. And that may save somebody a whole lot of repairs. And yeah, look at this thing. We can move How far away are you going today? Scott's filming. Two and a half hours. Two and a half hours. The customer's getting us delivered. And uh, 118 miles. Our, our truck will deliver. I'm about 100, I guess 25 miles. And then uh, otherwise we use a regular trucking company. Do you know now that probably 65%, maybe 70% of all of our business is outside of our delivery area? You're all having a hard time hearing me. You see that dazzling light show here? We have the super dazzling LEDs mm -hmm. for the flashlamps. Look at how devastatingly bright. Now who did 
this machine. That, that's that funny boy. No, not that, that, that funny boy. You, you, you do all the machines, don't you? You do all of them. He's doing the final touches on Cybernaut. That's, that's the, that odd looking boy over there. Cybernaut, another Cybernaut going out. Oh, and we have a surprise. We are going to make a limited run of Cybernaut pinball playfield plastics. A limited run. So we have them actually all off, ready to be scanned in. So we have a perfect set of plastics. We'll never get this opportunity again to make some wonderful plastics. Oh, you know what? I wanted to point out that Data East did a beautiful job on the back glass. They've mirrored it. So the characters all have this bead of mirror around it. It's beautiful, beautiful glass. Oh, and I think Mayfair Amusements still has some brand new ones in stock. Steve in, in New York, Mayfair Amusements. So if you uh, are in the market for one, very least you can hang it on the wall until you need it. I wish my wife would tell me to come again when I come back to see <laughs> Anyway. It's time we go. Hey, look, I wanted to show you this. Wasn't that a clever way of setting the soundboard off? See, the way Data East games work, when you turn it on, the soundboard is completely independent of the logic board. So, when you turn the game on, there doesn't even have to be a logic board in. That's the big board with the battery. The soundboard will always fire up that sound, even if there's no logic board in it. It's completely independent. Completely. Anyway, we're going to move on to Space Invaders. Okay, Frank, we've got to go. He's in my way again. Frank, Frank. Don't you know what happened the last time you messed with him? I don't think you have the balls. Touch me and die. Stay away from him. That's pretty smart. All right, smart I'm idea. Space invaders, a lot. And boy, do you have it! It is stunning. Believe it or not, this is only our eleventh Space Invaders Deluxe. We haven't sold a lot of these. Obviously, they made fewer. Now, this distinctive difference is it's got this red cabinet rather than the blue one. But this particular cabinet is in really nice shape. This guy has been waiting for this. I'm sorry you had to wait so long, but it was worth it because he got a brand new control panel overlay. A near perfect glass here. All the deluxe space invaders, by the way, were plexiglass. Cabinet's in great shape. This is our free play button. Look inside, you'll notice. It's got the color overlay on top of the, the picture tube. And as you remember, I told you, the black light in there is in fact, let me show you this way. The black light is one of the black light blue ones. See, they make the black light like this color, but then it reflects this. See the back? This is important. So it glows, but also lights the system. If we put a regular all black light in there, it wouldn't, you wouldn't see the planet as well. The glowing would happen, but you wouldn't see the, the background and um, the other good stuff that's in there. Frank, you just unplugged it. You, I'm sitting there going, why did the light go out? Uh-huh. 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 This, by the way, just sits like that. Does it? Doesn't get hooked up. Look, logic board. Frank, you worked on this board. And I believe you put all new ROM sockets in it. Yep. All five sockets are changed. And the processor right. Yeah. And we have a new edge connector. Now, I, Frank discovered wonderfully that Why edge connector great? is the weak point on all of these games, all the Bally Midway games. He discovered the JAMA connector is exactly the same. It's just too long. But I've it has the key before. at the right spot. So you can actually cut a Gojama connector down and you can use one end of the connector. See, look. So if it doesn't have the key in it, then... Yeah, if it doesn't have the key, it's not worth doing. It. Right, but if it has the key, then you don't have to worry and this one end is perfect, so when the customer puts this in, we're going to put a label on it to ensure nothing goes wrong. He will make sure he plugs it in this way, 
and nice and tight. Look at that. And now our They're logic all tied board together. So the two pins on either side, part side and solder side, are tied together and then connected down the other side. That's right. That's right. Because the original connector had one silver pin with one lead on it, so he had to add a second wire to it. You can do that simply by trimming your uh, JAMA connector for the two sides, so it touches the board on both sides. Frank, you did this wonderful job on this hook. We also have left the original connector in. See, we cut the wire so it'd be easy to rehook up the old power supply, but that's only if you're really anal. And I can't take credit. I didn't do that part of it. Oh, who did? Uh, Kristen. Kristen. Okay, so he did this, wired in a nice new power supply. Why wouldn't you treat your original logic board to a nice new power supply that supplies quality, steady voltage? Why? Why, Frank? Why? Because you might have to have the original one in there. I have to have the original. Oh, you, when you collect cars, you keep the original oil in it, don't you? And the original brakes in it. Well, our van outside with 138,000 miles on it still has the original oil and brakes, doesn't it? I hit the switch. Calm down. Hit the switch. The switch. Yeah. It, has the it sure drives like it does. It doesn't. It has the original <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm over here. I'm Nobody over cares here. About I'm over here. I'm over here. Nobody cares about it. This Nobody loads the program in. You. Oh, you know what? The back door is off. So we oh, can't. no. Anyway, look. Space Invaders we still don't have much to obviously. Don't embarrass yourself. I'm one, one of people. the best players on planet Earth. Yeah. Go ahead to have a Richie. Oh, you know what? We've got a really great video coming. No, Jersey no. Jack. Uh, open House is Saturday, and Richie Knuckles' podcast, uh, which I will be a part of, I will be on the podcast on Saturday night, and we're going to have them both in a combined video. Really um, unless fun unless fun. there's too much, then maybe we'll, uh, if, if there's too much, maybe we'll, we'll do two separate videos. Watch and tune in and find out. All right, well, let's come on over here, the Golden Eye. Do you know, this is our 16th Golden Eye. This one's special, and you know why? Home use only. We got this out of somebody's cellar. Frank, you're supposed to look at me when I say cellar. When I there look we, at you, I just... There's the cellar. Look, there's the cellar. When we I look at a, you and hear your voice, I just want to start smashing you over the head with a pinball leg, and I just don't want to stop until either I can't lift my arms anymore or the police show up. Did you up. see our Twilight Zone video? And that boy there, he attacked me because of that dumb camera. That boy right there. Look, he's working on Amazon. I didn't, I didn't uh, dub that out. I just, I mouthed it. Because we have little Fish. ears watching. Never mind. We have little ears watching. That's why I stopped myself. Uh, we do have to peel this off. Look. This one actually still has a coin activated Should I stop machine. what I'm doing and do that right now? It's the association. Why is it done yet? I better call him and see if he wants me to leave that on there. He may want me to leave that. But anyway, <laughs> let's get back to gold. <laughs> it's like brand new. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. We yeah, actually had another one we yeah. sold. I think yeah. uh, Christmas it was a homie only. We sold a few of these, I guess. Over the, Why um, are you uh, I just take great bills. You've already seen an extensive video on how it plays uh, recently. Why do you be careful before it falls off the dog? Yes, yeah, we have it propped up just so. When people play this game, tears run down their cheeks. Don't they? Yep, 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 yep. Steven loves it. Steven loves it when I do that. Oops. Not this. Shoot the flashing lamp. Well, shoot the flashing lamp. Frank, I, I, even, I forget how to play this. Shoot the flashing lamp. Not like you ever knew how. So I, don't I don't know how to play it now. And Frank, I thought you knew. I thought I knew everything, didn't you? No, I know that you know nothing. Just like me. You know nothing. Okay, well, I, I, I think we mentioned before, it does have the virtual lock. There's our satellite. Either one of these will lift the satellite. See, it's spinning. How lovely. Go through here. Electronically, goes up. There we go. That's better. And we go, go into the gold eye. 
I almost totally were trying. These are lit all with the super bright LEDs. Pinball light uh, has some wonderful LEDs. Every time I say the word pinball life, he gives me a thousand dollars. Pinball life, pinball life, pinball life, pinball life, pinball life, pinball life, pinball life. Frank, we have, we have enough to buy a toy. Because for every thousand he gives them, he spends five thousand. We're just kidding. I don't have any money. Frank, do we have time for another video or nope, should we just put this one out? No, you can't go. We have things to do. What's this weird shit? You know what? We're going to make this a short video. So we're going to end it. Can we, we give everybody a treat tonight? Yeah, but you know, we could go after soup. Uh, Are you still working on this? We just started. Actually, this was a the guy sent it to the overhaul. Wait a minute, you can't. Done. But, yeah, but Bye. Said, Wait a minute, you didn't do the electronics oh, yet. Well. Look, you didn't do the. Oh, oh look. It. It's got this wretched little board in it. This board is trouble. Folks. See what I did? Good look, night. You gotta come back here, young man. Now look, I'm just showed you something. You're all gonna hate me for this, but this board is nothing but trouble. This is the reset board, and this has caused well, thank me more God, grief. Thanks, thanks for destroying those posts that we could use in other places. Thanks. I'm making a point. That's what you do with that stupid. You're making board. a point with just destroy well, everything. Turn this right here. Gone. The original battery though, Frank. Look. Doesn't that wonderful? Oh, it fell up. Oh, look. Oh, no. Uh, it started to leak. Wow, look at that. Wow. Let's open it. Here. Did you call the battery manufacturer? Only a tiny bit of leakage. Not bad. We'll upgrade that. Oh, gosh. Yes. Frank, do you know what's going to happen with those emails? Where did that boy go? Steven! Nobody here by that name. Could do Sharky Shootout, but we should do a sub. There he is. He's back. See? Oh! You punched like a girl. That was a punch. Believe me, you would be sleeping right there. Would be really be around like a fish again. Out of water. Maybe we need to do a little vote here. How many people, uh, you know, think Stephen punches like a girl? If the vote should be who would win in a fight. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, I'll let you do five punches. I'll let you do the first five punches. He only needs one. <laughs> listen, he's half my age. Listen, if he was to punch half you... Half your size. Listen, if he was to punch you, with luck, you'll be coming out of your coma around the time he's coming out of jail. Then you'll get punch number two. Okay. Please, then... Walter is not getting my phone right now. Anyway. Anyway, anyway, we, we do have to end the video, so... Uh, it was over before I started it. That's Kurt. He's picking up again. Okay. Somebody is selling us back again. Good night, folks. Good night. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here!